What's up everybody and thank you for joining me for another video. My name is Wack4863, but you can call me Wack. In today's video, we are going back to EWA. That's right, I've got an EEWA Extended Endgame Weapons Arsenal guide for you today. And a lot of the times when I'm live streaming, I get questions about my horse, the spirit horse and where I got it. So today I'm going to show you how to get this bad boy. So what you're going to need in order to get the spirit horse is 40 spirit essence. And the guy that I'm walking up to right now is the one that's going to drop spirit essence. Now these guys are littered around the outside of the mounds of the dead. So you just need to come up and look for these guys. Now they are one shot, but when you kill them, they have this effect. And I'm going to do this a couple of times to show you how much damage you can actually take from being in that blast radius. Now again, these guys are littered around the outside of the Mounds of the Dead. However, it's going to be a grind to get up to 40. Most of them drop one essence. When you kill them, I have had some drop up to three essence. However, it's still gonna be a pretty good grind. Now watch this, I have 640 hit points and in the blast radius, I went all the way down to 88. That is a total of 552 hit points from that blast so you want to make sure you double roll to get out of it so needless to say stamina control is very important because you need to have the ability to have that double roll when you go up against these guys so make sure that your stamina bar is full they're very slow when you walk up to them so just wait until your stamina bar is full then do your single attack and then you'll have enough stamina to be able to roll away Something else that could be rather fun if you could get the timing right is to get the normal whites to stand in this explosion and as you can see it killed both of them right away. This is a bonus guy that can come at random from killing these guys. This is the cold monstrosity. Believe me, if you come up here in the wrong armor, you are going to be extremely cold to frostbite in a matter of seconds. So be careful and do not take this video for granted. This is not easy. I am a level 131. Now, once you have your 40 essence, you need to head over to the mysterious obelisk. But there's one more thing you're going to have to take with you. And that item just so happens to be a horse carcass. Yes, you have to have a dead horse in order to get a spirit horse. That's just the way it works. But once you have the 40 essence and the corpse of a horse, you can come over here, you can craft your spirit horse. It takes a little while, but again, this is how it's done. I want to remind everybody that this is a mod. It is from EWA, EEWA, Endgame Extended Weapon Arsenal, and you cannot do this in the vanilla game. And that's all I have for this video, but the fun doesn't have to stop here. There's a couple other videos coming up on the screen. You can pick one of those to watch next. I hope you've enjoyed this video as much as I've enjoyed making it. I'll catch you next time. Peace. I'd like to give a big shout out to all my YouTube members. Y'all are absolute legends. If you'd like to become a legend, there's a button below that says join. That'll give you all the details. I'd like to thank all my subscribers for their continued support, likes, comments, and general awesomeness. If you're not subscribed, you can start your free trial today and cancel at any time. Clicking the bell is highly recommended so you get notified when I upload another video.